Are you worried about whether you should have Richarlison in your side? The FPL Guide has got you covered. Last July in 2017, the then Watford manager spent his days unwinding from football by uh, watching Fluminese videos in his hotel room in the evening. He was scouting Richarlison. Three weeks later, he got his man. By July, Fluminese were midway through their season. Richarlison had made 22 appearances, scoring 7 goals, creating 4 assists, making him Brazil's top-scoring teenager. Between his final match for Fluminese and his first match for Watford, Richarlison had less than 3 weeks to move to Europe from Brazil, and during that time, he played a friendly. This all meant that by May 2018, Richarlison had played 59 first-team matches, and in his only break he moved continents and played a friendly. Last season, Richarlison's stats looked like this. He made 95 attempts on goal, with 22 of them on target. He scored 5 goals and missed 13 big chances. Richarlison made 4 assists and created 6 big chances for his teammates. Third among midfielders for shots and fourth for big chances. If he starts to convert these, his figures will be absolutely incredible. A change of manager saw a change of fortunes for Richarlison, with 5 goals and 4 assists under Marco Silva, and 0 goals and 0 assists under Garcia. Having finally had a break after 18 months straight football playing with a manager who literally speaks his language and is settled and now knows the Premier League, he's arguably playing with better players plus near the top of the league for underlying stats, it all suggests that 6.5 is a great price and would be madness not to have him in our teams. Thanks for watching the FPL Guide. Comment, like, and subscribe.